What is up, YouTube? Wonder One here, and I'm bringing you a Pokemon Showdown live. Um, I'm using the team that Leo t Leo gave me two teams the other day. Both of them are, I think, former R um, RMT teams that he's made adjustments to, and both pretty much centered around Scarm offense. Uh, basically, um, just Scarm and Hyper offense team. So uh, I'm using the second one. I used the first one a few times with uh, him. We were just playing for fun. I just wanted to get used to the team. Now I'm using the other one. I haven't really used it yet. So this is going to be fun. Is to just use it. Just just jump in. Uh, so um, first opponent here. Um, has a sand team, got Guard Chump, Terrakion, Espeon, Rotom, and Scizor. Scizor is probably banded. It could be banded source to source Rotom gave most of the Rotoms I've been facing lately have been just bulky Rotoms. Um, of course, uh, 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 what is it? Espeon here to stop uh, Hazards from setting up Terrakion to be Terrakion. It could be Scarf or Bandit, and then Source Dance, uh, Guard Chump, or, or just um, Sub in general, or in Special Defensive. Uh, uh, Tyranitar. So, I'm actually just going to start off with Scizor, predicting the Tyranitar. Hopefully, he does not have the, is not packing the uh, Fire Blast. If he is, I'm going to uh, just quit my life. <laughs> I'm just going to hit that rage, rage quit. That sounds bad because it sounds like I'm going to kill myself. I'm not going to do that, but I would not be happy <laughs> if he shows me the, um, if he showed me the Fire Blast. So basically, um, then I have Latios here. I didn't, uh, man, Latios, Life Orb. Um, Sub disabled Gengar, sorry, Scarf, Kelly, I forgot to tell you all this. Um, Lee, Skarmory with Custop, Custop, Skarmory with offensive EVs, and then Bandit, Terrakia. So I know nothing about this Rotom um, as of right now. So, um, Latios is a good Rotom counter, takes everything, has stuff for, you know, HP Ice. Now, I do know that I'm, that I'm in here that this uh, Rotom is Life Orb. So, I'm actually just going to go for the Surf predict the um, Tyranitar to come in but he goes to the scissor instead so they're probably going to tell me that he is all, he is bandit and that he's packing the pursuit I really wish that I had hidden power of fire but I do not so I'm just going to go for another surf since I may or may not be trapped in here I can't really take that chance to try to pull out yeah see I would have just died and now I got damage on him he's life orb um, all I have to do is get rocks up well, he got if he has that, then he has Roost. So, what I need to do is set up my hazards. Actually, I'm gonna go for the Raper predicting. Okay, okay, he just got damage on my Skarmory. I thought I really thought I didn't have hazards up. He could have went into Espeon, but I guess he predicted that. Didn't want to take that chance and just went for the Bullet Punch to get some damage off, which makes perfect sense. So, uh, now the Tyranitar's here. I guess we can. Uh, we can uh, do our thing with the hazards because I really felt no, yeah, he's just gonna let okay. Now he does have a fire blast, okay. Well, I mean, I don't understand why didn't he just use that at first, <laughs> okay? But uh, now I go into Rakion and I'm going to just I'm a Stone Edge. Um, it's probably safer just to close combat, but I want to take out that Espeon if that's what he's gonna go into. Predicting the close combat is the best thing he has to go into. Uh, he just sacks his Rotom. That is, that is going to die. Crit did not matter. And Bandit. And more than likely, he's going to go something that outspeeds me. Um, AKA just. Uh, and I do have the special defense rays from um, from the sand. So I'm really not as scared of this thing as he might think I am. He's going to just choose his time to go for a reflect. Even with the reflect up, that does 80%. That is outrageous. Oh my god. Bandit Terrakion. So, um, now that he's gonna die to Sandstorm and go in here, he's not gonna go for the HP Fire, he's gonna go for the Psychic, and then there we go. So, I can do that too. I can do the predictions too. Um, everything he has is susceptible to uh, Bullet Punch. Now, with this, Terrakion cannot take me out with one close combat. Uh, I feel like I can just Bullet Punch, and it's gonna be two hit KO. But I don't see him taking me out unless he's banded himself, and then that's gonna be annoying. Well, if he's banded, then it's fine because I have Gengar. So, yep, it looks like um, I do damage with this. He's just gonna go for Stone Edge. Gets crit. Uh, I don't know how much that matters. I am going to disable his Stone Edge that way, and then I'm going to sub up 
predicting switch to Tyranitar and then hopefully hit a focus blast that is the plan let's see if the plan comes together I'm not really worried about the reflect by the time that happens I think if this is not scarf um Keldeo just wins me the game with sir no I don't think so the secret sword how much health is Garchomp up uh, is that full so I need to I really need to take this out actually Garchomp Terrakion takes on Titar and Garchomp and hopefully his Terrakion is also banded. It, I don't know. I just kind of feel like it could be. And um, I hit the Focus Blast so it is my day. It's not luck to hit Focus Blast but when you do, you got to feel good about it. I'm just, I mean you just can't lie about that. Um, it is Scarf Terrakion which is fine. Um, I can take that with Tera uh, oh, <laughs> Scarf Terrakion. Scarf Garchomp. I can take that with Terrakion. Unfortunately, I am going to have to sack my um, Gengar in order to bring Terrakion in. And then, uh, I think I have HP Ice. Wait. Yeah, never mind. I just go to Keldeo and I just hit uh, Surf. Actually, I'm going to do HP Ice. Because <laughs> HP Ice hurts his uh, Terrakion as well. I don't know. I don't. This might be up to a speed tie. <laughs> oh my goodness. I don't know if it's banded or scarf. No, I, no, wait a minute. Nope. Come on. Stay focused. His guard jump is scarf, so his Terrakion is banded. So I'm just going to sack my Terrakion and go back to KLDO and hit the win button, which is surf. So that that is it. <laughs> Sorry about that. I obviously saw that his guard jump is scarf. So that was a good game. And um, yeah, that was a good game. Spaghetti O's. So, uh, yeah, let's get another one. Do, do, do. I'm going to make this about 20 minutes, hopefully. This is definitely going better than last time. Um, this guy has an Arcanine. Don't know what he's going to do in this in, on this team. Um, he does have Alakazam. Could be Life Orb. Could be Focus Sash. Most times, Focus Sash. He could be Bandit D Knight. It could be uh, D Dance. Same thing with um, Conquador there. It could be uh, Bulk Up. It could be Bandit. It could be. Flame or Flame or Buck Up, probably. Um, of course, the Snail Smash Coaster and Standard Dot Ferrothorn. So, uh, I'm going to start off with my Skarmory. And once again, I mean, if I analyze this team and see what I want to do, it's just weird that he goes straight for the timer button. I'm <laughs> like, is it, is it really called for? I mean, I'm just, I'm just looking at what I'm going against. I don't just look at a team and just, okay, I'm just going to pick this. So, I mean, I don't know. I just seem like the time board is very unnecessary to hit when it's only been 10 seconds. That's just my opinion. Uh, okay, so obviously he would have to know that I'm close up because I'm not taking any damage from. Uh, I mean, I'm not getting any leftovers. What do I want to go into? I go to Latias. Actually, I resist all his hits unless he has to crunch and he's going to predict that, which I don't think he's going to do either one. Goes for Wild Charge, that it's fine. I'm just going to go for a safe surf. Um, Ferrothorn might come in. Oh, he just leaves that in. Uh, with the hazards up, it's really dangerous for him to just come bring stuff in. He doesn't know what kind of Pokemon I am. And um, he's going to come in with the Cloyster. I'm going to, he might self smash, but I'm going to switch into um, my Keldeo because Keldeo resists all the moves. And I figured he would go straight for the Icicle Spitter. Uh, predicting me to stay again, predicting him to shell smash. So that was a good play on his part to do that. Uh, it just didn't work out this time. I'm just going to Secret Sword. It hits everything, even the Alakazam. If if it hits the Alakazam, I break his Focus Sash, and he's not going to switch out. Uh, I don't know if that's saying what kind of player he is or that he's just knowing that switching. I mean, he could have went to Dragonite. He doesn't know what kind of Keldeo I am, so he doesn't know if I have. Uh, I'm going to Skarmory. Just to basically die. I think I died to a focus blast at this amount of health. I'm just going to Brave Bird. And yeah, I do. So um, I know Scizor can live a hit and I can get a U turn off and then come back in later and um, and Bullet Punch. Uh, yeah, I might have to take damage, but it's okay. It's for the greater good. The greater good. So he's just going to go in his Conquer Daryl. That's fine because I'm just going to um, U turn out and go into my Latias. And I gotta keep the pressure on him. That's what Hyper Offense does. Um, he has a Toxic Orb instead of the Flame Orb. That's weird, but that's okay. 
Yeah, I'm just gonna go for the slice shock. That takes him out because I am life orb, and he's probably gonna come back into with Alakazam. No, he goes into Dragonite. Uh, e speed. It. I don't know. It, the the way he does that is telling me that he's banded because he believes that he can kill me with uh, Dragonite. Maybe he's bluffing it. It looks like he was bluffing the ban, and uh, I just called him out on it. Or you know. I'm saying that about my opponent, but I really don't know. Uh, I'm actually going to stay in this time. Am I going to stay in? I'm going to stay in and uh, just Draco Meteor again. Maybe here over predict and go for Focus Blast. He doesn't. He just goes for the Shadow Ball. Safe play. Uh, let's see. Basically, do the same thing. Come in. I know I can live Focus Blast with uh, Scizor. And I just U-turn, and then I would go into uh, kill the other speed and kill off. He doesn't have. I would have died. I probably would have died because that looked like it was a uh, uh, life orb. So um, that plan would not have worked. Oh, <laughs> uh, he was unlucky with the focus blast, and it's unfortunate. But I'm just gonna go for the close combat from that amount of health. So that that that's game. So GG. <laughs> All right, so. Twerking, twerking real hard for my points. <laughs> uh, I don't know what's wrong with me. Let's see, I have time for another. This might be the last one. I, oh my god, Terrakion just like poops on this entire team. The only problem is that Zoroark. I fall for it every time. It's I, he's speaking. I don't know what that. I don't. I don't know. <laughs> he just said something in a language I don't. I don't know what you said. I was like, I don't know what you said. I'm just going to taunt. He can't set up a sub. He can't sword stance. He can't get up his own rocks. Um, and so it's really beneficial for me. Unless this, <laughs> this is a Zoro rock, which it more than likely is. And uh, I'm going to get hit by a flamethrower. Uh, there it is. There it is. Not bad. So that's unfortunate. Um, I can go to Keldeo and just secret sword. He has nothing. Yes, don't you okay oh ah oh. <laughs> uh, okay I'm gonna secret sword he's got a focus sash uh, and he has extra century does he have the sucker punch this is a problem he's not gonna go for uh, fighting Thor this is safe yeah he has sucker punch I, I figured he would have sucker punch so uh, see every time Every time I knew the Zorak was there, I even predicted that to be the Zorak, and it, oh my goodness, it's just it happens every time. And I was just doing it. what do you mean? Why did I switch? Don't don't ask questions, man. If you don't understand my plays, why did I? He asked me why did I switch, which lets me know what kind of player he is. Um, he doesn't have any hazards up. Crazy, crazy Rainbow Star. Okay, I don't I don't even know anymore. Uh, I'm going to go in Latios. <clears throat> Sorry, because I resist his stab. Um, if he wants to predict me going into Keldeo, which which would be crazy because it's almost dead. I guess I could sack Keldeo. Uh, I really don't want this to be my last my last battle. I hate when people ask me, why did you do that? It's not like he's calling me out. I guess he legitimately wants to know why I switched. But he doesn't have any hazards on my side of the field, so I'm free to switch. Now, if he came back in with Bisharp, I would maybe predict that to have um, Stealth Rock, but I don't know. So, <clears throat> it does have the possibility, and I could switch in, and he's taking his time. Okay, can you please come on? I'm twerking real hard from the points. It's, it's, look at that. You see? He's twerking. I don't even know who this is. Who is this? I just noticed that it, it went well with my name, so that's the only reason I picked her. So, uh, you know, if this... Okay, I was like, if you don't make a move soon, then I'm just gonna... Oh my goodness, that hurts. That hurts so much. Uh, he doesn't really have anything to take a Draco Meteor. No, he does have something to take a Draco Meteor. What are you doing? Ah! <laughs> okay, he just dies. He does not die. Uh, is this... Uh, is, is this... Scarfed. I'm just gonna go for the surf. No, it's not scarfed. I was like, this is not threat to me. What was the end game here? I know I lose two. I mean, two levels of special attack, but still, unfortunately, unfortunately, unfortunate. Uh, I'm at nine percent. I cannot live. <sighs> I'm going to Scizor. 
He's just gonna show us dance. Um, I gotta figure out what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna U-turn, go into Gengar. If he sucker punches, I'm gonna go into Gengar. If he does not, okay. And he had the Dark Gem. Okay, so I'm gonna go into Gengar. Actually, you know what? Terrakion. No, Terrakion destroys the rest of his team. Please, 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 sucker punch me. I'm begging you. And he does. Thank you. Okay, well, he's just going to go into Sharpedo, so I don't know why I police all the time. I outspeed everything he has, so, uh, I mean, I outspeed Sharpedo. More than likely, he's just going to, yeah, he's going to come out and he's going to do that. Um, I'm going to go into my Keldeo. If he goes for the Protect, if he doesn't, okay. So, I think I might still outspeed. If he's a good player, he's going to go for that Protect again. He has to Focus Sash. Okay, that's two Pokemon with Focus Sashes. I already hate you. What are you doing? Has the Focus Sash. I go to my Scissor, Bullet Punch. Not a problem. Um, he could go into his Arcanine, but I really don't care. He And that's what he's going to do. He's going to go into his Arcanine. I'm going to break his Balloon. I get the crit. Sorry about that. But I, I didn't choose to do that. I'm at one... I'm just going to Bullet Punch again to get some damage off. Yeah, because uh, I really wish I had saved that for Sharpedo. That was not a good idea on mine. Um, let's see. I got the Cussed Out. I don't know if it works with it Protect. No, yeah, he did not protect. Okay. I was kind of curious to cuss that work if he protects. Um, it didn't. And I go into this. Uh, I guess if he has bullet punch. He keeps talking. I don't know why he keeps talking. I just realized I had quick attack. Stop having Sash. Oh my god. He has Sash on everything. This is the third Pokemon with Sash. I'm going to end it with this. I mean, I'm just going to end it with this, with this battle. I'm going to go into... Ladia, show me extreme speed, please. Please show me extreme speed. Okay, you didn't do that. All right, so that was an interesting game. Um, he keeps talking. <laughs> he just keeps talking. I have no idea what he. He keep. He just keeps doing it. I don't. I don't even know. I think I should get one more to. Um, to get that one out. <sighs> this is gonna be fun. Hmm. Okay. Mhm. Mm mhm. Mm I'm gonna start with Skarmory. He's gonna start off with Minchow. Not bad. Um, if he Scarf, locking himself into High Jump Kick would be not the. I, why do you, I don't understand why people do that? It does nothing. That did nine percent. That did just as much to him as it did to me. I I never understand that. And let's see. Any U turns? Okay. Why didn't you just do that at first? Never understand flinching. I mean, fake out, ing, faking out. Yeah, there we go. Faking out still types. I never understood it. I think I've done it to him in the past. Uh, he's gonna go to Ferrothorn. Thinks we're gonna exchange rocks. It is customary to exchange rocks on the first turn. Um, we didn't do that. He faked me out. I couldn't do it. I would have done it on the first turn. I tried to, but he, you know, whatever. <laughs> so I'm gonna taunt him. So he can't get his stuff out, and then I'm just going to spike up. If he quit, this is going to be the last game. <laughs> anyway, it goes, this is the last game. So hopefully, he decides to go with Gyro Ball. He doesn't have a spinner. This is very beneficial for me. I'm faster than him, so once Taunt runs off, I can just Taunt again. And I do have Cut Stab, so if he decides for some reason, um, I should just like straight out switch to Gengar, which I am going to do, because I feel like he's just going to fake out. Oh, he goes for the taunt. This thing has taunt. Hello, help me. I don't know. <laughs> is it you? Is it, you? Is, it, is it you I'm looking for? I can see it in your eyes. <clears throat> he goes for a U-turn. He dies to hazards. He, uh, he dies to life orb. I didn't even notice that the first time. Yeah, that's why he took as much damage as I did. Life orb, fake out on um, Skarmory. I don't understand. I don't understand it. I'm, I, I, I'm trying to understand, but I don't understand why people use that set. It's so bad. It probably works in like 
situational stuff, but I do not like fake out men shout. That's just my personal opinion. I'm not calling anybody dumb for using it. I just don't like it. <laughs> uh-huh, I'm gonna have to hit the start. Okay, he he switches in when I hit the thingy. Sorry, sorry. Uh, let's see. And you got scissor, scissor, kilio, kilio, scissor, scissor, kilio, kilio, scissor. Hmm. I could go to Skarmory. Maybe he's a curse set, and then I could just taunt him. Oh, bulk up set in that curse. Uh, let me go into Scizor. And he drags it in. I don't like this set either. <laughs> I'm sorry. But when you drag it in, and you still get outsped by base 115 Pokemon, it's really weird. So he just goes for Dragon Dance again. I'm going to U-turn. <clears throat> See, watch. Watch this. He got two Dragon Dances, right? Two Dragon Dances. I have a Scarf Keldeo. I am going to be faster than him. I just want you to know how slow this Pokemon is to have Dragon Dance. That is ridiculous. <laughs> I told you. Two Dragon Dances and Scarf Keldeo is still faster. That's why I don't like that set. Bulk Up, Dragon Punch is my favorite set. Now... Dragon Dance Moxie, it is a threat. I've used it before, but this, I mean, like I said, after two Dragon Dance, you still get outsped by a base, uh, what is this, 17, no, it's not 115, it's not even 115, this is like 112 or something, uh, Scarf 112, so this is a good switch, he's going to go into this, it's not really, I kind of just want, is he going to talk to me, I'm just going to, okay, I didn't do that much. He's gonna talk to me. That's fine. Uh, let's see. I'm just gonna Secret Sword again. And I create him. I'm sorry. I can't help that. My, my, you see the horn? It's well trained. I, I don't even know what to say about that. I, I do apologize for that. It sucks. Um, but I don't really know what his game plan was. He has a lot of fire types. He has a lot of grass types on his team. And to tell you the truth, I'm still going to stay in, in Secret Sword. I feel like that's the best bet. I'm just going to get some damage on this. It can't put me to sleep. It's not going to be able to set up. And I just punched the mic a little. Um, I, does it have Life Orb? No, it doesn't. That's Toxic Orb. Okay, so. Uh, let's see. I could go into. I'm going. I can go into anything, to tell you the truth. It, just, it really does not matter. But I'm going to go on the Gengar. Just because uh, if he decides to go into Ferrothorn, I can set up a sub. I can disable him from getting up a bunch of hazards. Um, it just works out for me. This way I can't get hit by Mog Punch. Even though I don't know if that this set carries it because it is Toxic Orb. So it more than likely it's not. Oh yeah, he, has, he still Sea Bomb and not um, Bullet Seed. So it, yeah, that's not that set. So uh, I don't have anything to worry about. I am going to sub so he can't lead Seed me. And then uh, focus blast or focus miss depends on what depends on how you feel about the move, and uh, we go from there. So just waiting on him. I'm not singing. I'm not going to sing at the end of this video. There's no. Okay, late super late game rocks. Not bad. Can yeah, and I hit. So that's one. I just got to hit two. I'm just <laughs> unprotected focus blast. Not bad. So I am I'm three for three for focus blast today. And this guy is gonna play this out. Not bad. So I, I'm just gonna shot a ball. If he puts me to sleep, I'm gonna be very upset because I'm like, what's the point? If if Roseway sweeps me, I'll be upset. Okay, he just went for the storm. Okay, so that was a good game. GG. Um, I hope you enjoyed the battle. Um, well, the battles. The first one was like the best one. It was it was hard. I almost wanted to just stop after the first one, but I kept going, and it was fun. So I uh, hope y'all enjoyed. You know, and um, thanks to Leo for giving me the team little tweaks he did here and there. I'm not exactly sure how much it changed. Like I said, I don't use, I don't go through RMTs and stuff like that, so I don't recognize them when when they're in front of me, um, and I don't really recognize when I'm using them. Um, use I just. I like making my own teams, but I like to use other people's teams too because I want to showcase um, their skills in making teams as well. Because uh, I don't, 
I don't have the best faith in my own the team building skills, skills, but I am not afraid to make my own team. So whatever, like 99% of the teams I use are mine anyway. But like I said, I'm just babbling now. I'm just whatever. I, you know, you know, if you've been a fan of my, uh, if you've been sub to me for a while, you know I used to do this all the time. So I'm gonna stop. Thank you very much for watching. Um, you know, watch my other vid. I uh, have two other vids after this that you should watch. And uh, I'll see you next time. Peace.